the scout, Julie. When it comes to car seats, there are an endless amount of choices to make. Do I get an infant car seat and a convertible car seat? Do I just get a convertible car seat? Do I get a convertible car seat and a booster seat? It is overwhelming. Luckily, Graco has made some of these decisions a little easier for you by designing a car seat that can accommodate all of that. The Graco Forever All-in-One Car Seat, which gives you 10 years with one seat. Take that in. You can use it with your newborn as little as four pounds with the use of the infant insert, all the way up to 120 pounds or four foot nine, which sidebar, did you know that your child needs to be in a booster seat until they're at least four foot nine? I did not know that. I did a double take. <laughs> First, it can be used for a newborn in the rear facing position. And then when your child reaches the maximum height or weight for rear facing, you can then turn it around to be used as a forward facing car seat up to 65 pounds. Now, when your child is able to sit still for every ride for the entire ride, or when they reach 65 pounds, you can then convert it into a high back booster. And that accommodates a child from 30 to 100 pounds. And then finally, it converts into a backless booster. And you use that with your car's seat belt. And that accommodates a child from 40 all the way up to 120 pounds. Whew. Let's just like take a minute, take all that in. It's so much to digest. As a rear facing car seat, it comes with an infant insert that's removable and machine washable. Both the head and the body pads are separate, so one can be used without the other. There's a five point harness with a chest clip and a buckle. To loosen the straps, you simply press down on this button under the flap in the front, and then you pull down on them. This strap in the front is what allows you to tighten the straps. There are six different recline positions, three for rear facing, two for forward facing, and one for booster. A level indicator bubble shows if it's installed in an acceptable recline position. Here's one of my favorite features. As your baby grows, the headrest and the harness are on a sliding scale that you can adjust into 10 different positions without re-threading the harness. Again, without re-threading the harness. Do we need to take another minute? When your child reaches the maximum weight or height in the rear facing position, you can then turn the car seat around into the forward facing position. Installation in every position is pretty straightforward with the seat's latch connectors, rear or forward facing. The use of the top tether forward facing with harness is recommended. Now, once your child reaches 45 pounds, roughly around five years old, you will need to switch over from using the latch system to using the seat belt and tether installation. Everything is color coded and easy to understand. You should be aware that the Forever does not have seat belt lock off. So you'll wanna look at your car's manual to see how your car's seatbelt locks to be sure that it's safely and securely installed with the seatbelt. I'll admit that installation of the car seat can feel challenging, but this is why I recommend looking at the user guide because it'll answer any questions that you have and it's well worth the read. The car seat cover is easy to remove and wash when it gets dirty and the seat comes with two cup holders. I'm not really sure why your child needs two cup holders, but who knows, one could be for a drink and one could be for a pacifier. The Forever is considerably more expensive than other Graco convertible car seats, but it's a one and done deal. So think about all the time and money you'll be saving, not having to research and install various car seats through the years. So yes, it is expensive upfront, but money saving overall. This car seat does take up a lot of space. So if you have a smaller car, it may only fit in the middle and the back. Also, the booster portion itself is pretty wide and bulky. So it's something to think about if you have three car seats that you need to fit across your back seat. Overall, this car seat is super versatile, user-friendly, and comfortable for your child. So you can feel comfortable when driving your precious cargo around town. I really, really hope this helped making choosing the right car seat a little easier for you. Hey all, Babyless Scout Julie here, talking about one of my favorite baby products on the market, the Graco Extend-A-Fit Convertible Car Seat. There are so many decisions that go into choosing a car seat. I know that when we were choosing for our daughter Sophie, the main priorities for us were safe, 
not too expensive, and easy to install. Then we read that the Academy of Pediatrics recommends that your baby ride rear-facing for longer. Granted, it varies state by state. Even so, with that said, when we discovered the Graco Extend-to-Fit, we knew that would be the right option for us. Let's dive into why this is called Extend-to-Fit and why it's unique from other car seats on the market. It has a four position extension panel that provides five inches of extra leg room. So when your baby seems like they're getting squished riding rear facing, this gives them more leg room, therefore making them more comfortable to ride rear facing longer. It can accommodate your baby from as little as four pounds all the way up to 50 pounds rear facing. In fact, with a weight limit of 50 pounds, your baby can ride rear facing for years to come. Once they've reached the recommended weight or height riding rear facing, you would then switch the car seat around to be in the forward facing position. And that can accommodate your baby from 22 up to 65 pounds. Installation of the extent fit is pretty straightforward with the seat's latch anchors. There's also a bubble indicator that shows if you've installed the seat in the correct level position. And it features a six position recline. Positions one through four can be used rear facing and positions four through six can be used forward facing. Plus my favorite thing about this car seat is that it has a no rethread adjustable harness. So you can easily adjust the height of the harness and headrest as your child grows without having to take the whole seat apart and rethread. Love. Thank you. There are 10 positions that grow with your baby. You just wanna make sure that their head is at least one inch below the handle. It has a five point harness and bus free harness storage. There are two pockets on the sides that you can tuck the clip into in order to easily get your baby in and out of the car. That is super helpful because Sophie gives me a good wrestle getting in and out of this car seat. The car seat cover is removable and machine washable, although I gotta say, it wasn't the easiest thing for me to remove, so I like to spot clean this baby. And the car seat comes with two cup holders. You know, for when your child needs two drinks. <laughs> In all fairness, Sophie has asked for milk and water at the same time. Small car families should be aware that this leg panel does mean that the car seat takes up more space, which might make the front seat passenger sacrifice on space a little bit, perhaps be a little squished. It might lend itself better to larger cars or minivans. Doesn't really bother us, but might bother some. Ultimately, you want a car seat that's good for you and your family, so making informed decisions about features and safety will help you decide which one to register for. I was able to make sense of the latest top-rated seats from Graco and decided to try out their forever DLX 4-in-1 convertible car seat. It made some upgrades for safety and convenience, but it still has four modes that allows you to really use the seat forever. <laughs> from birth to elementary school. I started looking for a convertible car seat because my son was reaching the weight limit on his infant car seat. But since you can use this one from birth, this could have been the only car seat I ever needed. The only thing that really would have made a difference is that a convertible car seat is around double the weight of an infant car seat and is designed to be installed in the car and stay put while an infant car seat can be removed from the car and go into a stroller base or just hang on your arm. If you do opt to make this your one and only, here is how it will grow with your child. You'll start out using the seat rear facing with a harness when they're the smallest in that first year or two. Once they reach the weight or height limit and can sit up unassisted, you can convert to forward facing. And you'll be in this mode for a while until they're four and then you'll convert to the high back booster so long as your now big kid is tall enough. And then finally, you'll reach the end of your car seat journey with the backless belt positioning booster. There are tons of color coded guides on the product itself and in the manual to help make things clear for you. As your baby grows, there's lots of adjustability so the seat can comfortably grow with them. The Simply Safe Adjust Harness System lets you adjust the harness and headrest together to 10 different positions, and you can also adjust the recline to six different positions. Installing your car seat in the car and your baby in the car seat is where the upgrades from the Forever to the Forever DLX really show most. While they both have an in-right latch system, the Forever DLX has an integrated belt lock-off option as well, making installing the seat with just the seat belt 
that much easier and secure. The DLX also has what they call rubberized, fuss-free harness storage. So you can tuck in the ends of the harness clips so you can easily take baby in and out. And in booster mode, there's also a compartment storage in the DLX that keeps all the unused harness straps tucked away nicely when you're using the seat belt instead. Another upgrade was making the seat fabric easy to remove and throw in the wash. It's called a rapid remove cover. And I actually was able to remove it in around 60 seconds, like Graco said. Not an upgrade, but also worth mentioning that the two cup holders are removable as well, which makes them nice and easy to clean. The last thing I'll mention is the look. My husband and I were both like, wow, we actually love this car seat when it arrived. It blends nicely with the interior of my car and the padding is really cushy and well-made. Overall, if you're looking for an all-in-one car seat from a highly trusted brand, then the Forever DLX is a really solid option. All of their car seats pass the safety tests. But this one does strike a good balance. Hey, I'm here to share with you guys the Graco Snug Ride Snug Lock 35 Infant Car Seat. I have all the product details in order to help you decide if it's the one and some pros and cons too. I've been using this seat for my daughter for about six months now. For reference, she's 15 months old, 23 pounds, and about 30 inches tall. This car seat is definitely on the lighter side at only seven and a half pounds without the base. The weight capacity is one of my favorite features. You can use the Snug Ride Snug Lock 35 infant car seat from four pounds all the way up to a whopping 35 pounds or until your babe reaches 32 inches. The Snug Lock in the title refers to how you install this puppy. There's a Snug Lock technology that helps provide a secure base install in just three steps and you can use just a seat belt. Lock in the title is also important too, because that means that you're getting Graco's updated version of the much loved Click Connect infant car seat. One good thing though is that if you do have the Click Connect strollers or bases, the Snug Ride 35 is likely compatible. When it comes to safety, there are a few smart features like energy absorbing foam for effective impact energy management and four recline positions on the base with an easy to read level indicator. A few final features worth noting are the rotating canopy and the fact that the seat cushion is machine washable. The expiration date is really important to note too. Yes, car seats really do have them. This model expires seven years from the manufacturing date. So that means that you might get use for more than one kiddo. The seat I have here is a base model, but if you want a few extra features like a one-hand adjust or snazzier fabrics, there are a lot of variations and a few deluxe models available. So let's recap on the pros and cons. It's nice and lightweight with a pretty solid weight limit of 35 pounds. It has snug lock technology, which makes the install nice and, well, snug. It's easy to add to a Click Connect stroller, which gives you mobility in and out of the car. And it's pretty inexpensive, like less than Brytax or Chico infant car seats. But should you choose to splurge, there are a couple upgrade options, like plush fabrics, fancier sunshades, and harnesses that are easier to adjust. A few things to consider though, specifically for this base model. Some babyless parents were put off by the lack of head support and thickness of the headrest. And the fabric on the base model is not the softest. I felt it. It might get a little toasty during my Florida summers. I've also found that the button to loosen the straps is pretty hard to find under the fabric.